Guys, when you got four people bidding, you know you're getting them Spring auction season is upon us. Got the International 650 on propane. And we've got a friend learning the ropes of picking. <laughs> Hello, this is Blaine. Gibson Ready Mix Concrete International Truck. We will revisit that one in a minute. Supposedly there's a huge assortment of outback barn finds. That one's a mystery to me. Not quite enough there to tell what it is. Hmm. I don't think anything that came on this place ever left it. <laughs> Tonnage. There's the tonnage. And garbage. Tonnage and garbage. People tell me that and I take it as a challenge. <laughs> There's enough of both. You know, I... Pick it and prove, prove them wrong. Lots of future junk lanterns laying around. <laughs> it's floating along. They're massy hiding in the trees. Down the meandering lane of junk. There's the barn where the barn finds originated. Did I tell you my wacky idea for fuel tank? Mm -mm. Uh, cut the ends off and paint signs on them. There you go. Be cheaper than buying one. Yep. I think this is where the 69 and the, maybe the Studebaker were. The old stone barn. Rim entire city, Joel will be happy. Look at the barn finds. Model A chassis, slightly reconfigured. <laughs> the wheelbase might work for a T bucket, but not for a stock Model A.
What year is it? Come on. Come on, man. I'm debating. I got in the big debate on the internet as usual with some guy about how many different sizes of slant sixes are. Two? Three. Three? The one seventy to one ninety eight and the two twenty five. Oh yeah. And he swears, he's like, There's no one seventy. Three pedal versions, kind of neat. John's gonna buy all the beer. Rust free went out in Western. <sighs> yeah. <laughs> you guys will do all the welding to destroy one. Why not do all the welding to fix one? <laughs> <laughs> if, if I sat and told you all the horror stories of all the low mileage cars that we stripped and wrecked, you would you would cry after the first three minutes. <laughs> We'd run out of Kleenexes after an hour, and then I'd call my friends in to tell the same stories. See, that's the difference between me and you. I want to do welding and have 20, 30 years to enjoy a car. You want to get a summer out of it. This is a really good... Honest Survivor Patina car. Needs a little clean out, but it'll clean up. We've already had a Will It Run for this one. He says it purrs like a kitten. Same deal on the Biscayne. Kind of an odd one, 327 automatic four door. It's a good old survivor car. Studebaker, another good survivor. 52, I'm going to guess. Not exactly an expert. You're, you're the worst person to talk to today. Look at that thing. Automatic. Imagine the logic in 52. You visit the showrooms. Fortomatic power glide or this. I really like this. It's a good survivor. Chevy truck. This international. It's kind of a neat one. 58960. Shame somebody put the primer on here. Who's ever seen a split rim artillery? That's a new one for me. Sixty seven. Small back window, no side marker lights. That was a decent workable truck. Short bed Ford. Somebody will want that. He said that Oliver runs. He said the John Deere's locked up. A lot to see out here.
Chevy's got significant cab rust. All the panels are available, but you still got to put them in. Another identical international. Nope, 57. That's a cool one. Here's a power wagon. Three quarter ton, four wheel drive. Club cab. It's a good desirable barn find unit. This one would be ideal Cummins swap. Guessing all four brakes locked hard on this old IH. Hmm. Pretty sweet barn find though. V8 model. Last sticker on the battery. 2011. See, kind of a neat one. Hopefully, it escapes the scrap man. How we doing? <laughs> we have got another GMC. Knocked in the front, but still gives it kind of a good rustic look. And the Dodge. We had a guy begging and begging and begging for 57 Dodge doors. Go find the truck and it's messing the doors. It's kind of a neat one. A lot of good parts. A lot of 57 stuff is one year only. El Camino topper. Quite the mix of Agricultural leftovers. That's a pretty neat little airport tug, probably. Looks like a Chrysler Straight Six, Dodge or Plymouth. Looks a little short, it might be a Plymouth. An old C10 with the cool topper. Mind you of Travels of Charlie. John Steinbeck, I think that one was an early 60s GMC. Formal. Travels with Charlie. Big GMC with the five window cab. Mix of brands, but a lot of John Deere. Chevy truck, another GMC.
There's supposed to be an international out here that's totally full of alternators. Kind of looking to spot it somewhere. This Ford Courier's neat. Not something I'm into though. International half ton two wheel drive hiding in the trees. Lodestar, another old Chevy. This old Ford. Fifty one or two. It's got the letters on the hood emblem instead of the V eight badge. Upside down truck cab back here. Take a look and see. There's another right side up truck cab. Old Chevy. Upside downer is a Chevy. Wow, that thing's pretty shot. The rest of it's a pickup bed trailer somewhere. International KB. Kind of a neat one. Fifty four. Three quarter ton. Another forward here. Nah, it's an international. That's got the sliding back window. No, it's a Dodge. So a little here. Sliders aftermarket, I think. So a little hard. So a little here, it's hard to tell right off, but that's got the cow lights, so it's definitely Dodge. Looks like a uh, Alice Chalmers. Reaper of some sort, pull type combine. Right here, 62 International. I think they call this the Travelette. Four door short bed pickup. Pretty neat vehicle. Obviously the ten norms have been munching on it. Still a rare and unique enough vehicle that it'll be probably reborn. I know a lot of this looks like junk, and most of it probably is, but dig a little. There's definitely diamonds to kick out of the dirt.
pretty big assortment here of relics out of the sheds and farmhouse. This is clearly more than one generation's worth. A lot of these things are 80, 90, 100 years old. Good old mix of all kinds of primitive relics. They worked out here for probably the better part of a month cutting trees and just getting stuff sorted out. This is a pretty rough place. Guy did live here, but just totally overgrown with trees and all these buildings were pretty decayed so some of the roofs are bad and they did pretty good I think at sorting a lot of stuff out amazing old survivor here World War II era Wichita phone directory super super neat piece I have a thing for old telephone books so that one's definitely on my list this will be a two ring sale so there'll be a lot of running back and forth. Fortunately, Blaine's here, so he's going to watch one of the rings, and I'll leave a few bids with him. This amount and this volume of stuff, if they just sold in one ring, they'd never get through it all in a day. <laughs> this particular auctioneer does move along pretty quick. Some of these old oil cans they took out of the workshop there. There's some common ones, but there are a couple pretty rare ones in the bunch. I've definitely got my eye on them. We'll see what happens. These early spring sales, they always bring out the collector types. And just seems like there's a lot of interest when you get this nice of a volume of stuff some of it that's laid around this long you always wish the condition could be a little better but at the same time the fact that it survives is most important of all Morning, well, Gordon. Hey, Tim. Here's a, <laughs> a watch of quarter. Uh, something in a dairy, but I'm not sure. Yeah, I have no idea. Oh, there's uh, more than one of them. Yeah. Two day auction here. Yeah, I think it's going to be a two ringer at least. Yeah, you can see, I think there's a bunch of tools in the boxes right there. 
there's some uh, right, him, the up there. Yeah, there. there. I don't know what you think. Oh, oh. Okay. Yeah. Yes. 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 Old truck. Wait. Start it up. Yep. Can you start this thing up? No. <laughs> Alright guys, gonna tell you the old truck right there. Somebody give me 200. Give me started. 200. Two, you get gonna do two. I got two and two and a quarter and a half, two and seventy-five, and three and three and three fifty, three fifty, and four and four and four and four and four. And four, and four. I got three fifty here and four and four and four hundred and four fifty, four fifty, and five 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 fifty, five fifty and six and six fifty, six fifty, and seven, 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 seven fifty, seven fifty, seven fifty, seven fifty, and eight and eight and eight fifty, eight fifty, and nine. Nine, nine, nine and a half, nine fifty, nine fifty, one thousand. One thousand, one thousand, one, one, two. Two, two, one thousand, two, one thousand, two, one thousand, two, and three, and four, 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 four. I got thirteen hundred. I got thirteen hundred and fourteen. Fourteen hundred, fourteen hundred. Thirteen and fourteen and fourteen and fourteen and fourteen and fourteen and fourteen. So thirteen hundred dollars. Fire number two seventeen. Two seventeen. All right, guys. I got a little motor right there. I got the corner fans right here. Six fifty or nine. All right, we go ahead on it. It turns over with the starter. I didn't quite get the start. You can see I was doing some tuning up on it. Uh, probably not going to take much to get it to start. It does have a little leak on the propane tank on the fill valve, and the tires are what you see. But I don't think it's going to take much to run. I put a gallon of antifreeze in it. It did not run into the oil pan or onto the ground. So it would appear that it's going to hold antifreeze. All right, guys. You heard it. It's, it's a bit of an antique right there. All right. Somebody start me off at 2000 Two, you get a two, two, two thousand, two, two, two thousand, two thousand, two thousand, two thousand. Two thousand. What are you guys starting at? Thousand dollars. One, you get one, one thousand, one, one, one thousand, one, one, one. Two hundred. I got two hundred. Three, three, two, three, three, three. three. You get a three and four and four, 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 four. I got, I got three here and four. Four hundred, four, four, four and five and six and seven, 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 eight, 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 eight. 12 and 12 and 13 and 13 and 13 and 13 and 13 and 14 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 he found some out at that one sale that people had interest in. That one in Larned. No. Uh, wherever that, that one when it snowed, I don't remember. The 30 strucks. Truck and all, 800, 80 quarter, 8 and a 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 quarter, 8
Yep, yeah, but. <laughs> all righty, guys, like Kenny said, it all goes one unit that's going to buy it all. Somebody give me about uh, $1,500. $1,500, $1,500, $1,500, $1,500. Give me $1,000. Let's go. $1,000 bill. We do one, 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 $1,000, $1,100. $1,000, $1,100. $1,000, $1,100. $1,000, $1,100. $1,000, $1,100. $1,000, $1,100. $1,000, $1,100. $1,000, $1,100. $1,000, $1,100. $1,000, $1,
Nine yep, yep, yep. Ten hundred. I'm ten, ten, nine, and ten hundred. Yep. Nine and ten, eleven, no. twelve, thirty, yep. thirty, yep. forty, thirty, forty, 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 fifteen hundred, yep. fifteen hundred, under fifteen, fifteen, fifteen hundred, under fifteen, fifteen, fifteen hundred, under fifteen. Fourteen and a half. Fourteen and a half. Fourteen and a half. Fifteen hundred half. Fifteen hundred half. Fifteen fifty. Fifteen hundred half. Fifteen hundred half. Sixteen hundred. Sixteen half. Sixteen fifty. Sixteen half. 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 Sixteen
I got a standing by in Arizona. 1800, 1800, 1800, 1800, 1900, 1900, 1900, 1900, 1900, 1900, 1900, 1900, 1900, 1900, 1900, 1900, 1900, 1900, 1900, 1900, 1900, 1900, she's got copies of some of them and this may be one of them, but not, you know. You got 1850 already, 19, 19, 1900, 1900, 18 and a half of 19, 1900 here, 19 and 19 and 19, get it 19, did it get over here 19, 1900, thank you, 50, 1950, 1950, 19 and a half, guys, you got four people bidding, you know, get money, 1950, 1950, anybody, 1950, last call, 19 is 50, 1900, 200, 200 like, hey, I say yes to his fly. Did he see that? Huh? I say yes to his fly. Did he see that? Oh, sure. Unfortunately, this has been setting out a while, guys. But you heard him run. I'll tell you there. Somebody give about $800 for it. Hey, you're going to wear Eight hundred, that battery in the dog, see if it'll turn. It's keys in it. Ignition's on. You're in this car? so what'd you get there, Mr. Good Flyers? Uh, I think it's a 78. You might try to Cool. Yeah, standard process, you gotta evict the critters before you really start working on it. I think there will be a lot of homeless small creatures after this sale. These are mud daubers. They use mud to make nests. And they're everywhere. They're little. Yeah. Three and a half, 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 three and a half
Oh, yeah. Okay, stop. Up, up. Flip that over the fender. Uh, should be able to. Hold it. Okay. Good. Straight, hey, uh, go straight with the trailer. Turn a little bit to the left. Good. Go ahead. Okay, hold it. Uh, turn left a little bit. Good. Yeah, you're dead on. Okay. Keep it straight. Okay. Go ahead. 